go just unstoppable when I've got my makeup on, you know? I'm just Tanya. Hey y'all, this is Burnt Beauty 2018. I am here today to answer the age old question. What do we do when we're in a super hurry? We're really running late. But we gotta look super fly. And we're burn survivors. We don't wanna go without foundation to wherever it is. I mean, I'm fine just like this, but I'm just saying, wherever it is we're going, we wanna look glam. We don't wanna do our everyday look. What's required? Let's start. Number one is never skip your skin care. We, regardless of what's going on, we don't skip our skin care. It's too important to our look. We need everything to be as smooth and as plump as it can be. I could go right now. I could put on a wig and some lip gloss and go right now. <laughs> Next is some Tula Blurring Primer. Because the blur is going to make everything a lot easier for you. Lancome Fonda Tint Foundation. Look at the way it matches my skin. What? It's all over my face. <laughs> In a stick, full coverage foundation. And on the other end of the stick is a kabuki brush that I highly recommend using instead of your regular makeup brush. It's seems to work a lot better. Okay, so the foundation is on, and yes, it is full coverage, but I am a burn survivor, so this is how it works. And notice, y'all, that I'm pushing this foundation and I'm not rubbing it. I'm pushing it into my skin. Okay, but first, just had to put water on me. Don't forget to put your bib on. If you're already dressed, get these on Amazon. Put them below. Friend brought me mine. <sighs> Much better. <laughs> so, eek! as to contour, I use a light color, a dark color for the shadows, and then I have one color that is very close to my color. And it's a lot, but I'm using it to really get full coverage, and I've even put it on my lips. It comes with a brush on the end. Start with the light. Everything we're doing, we work up. We want everything to lift our face up. We never want to drag it down. Dry Beauty Blender. Now we're gonna make a difference. Now we're gonna make a foundation. I have to draw my lip, my top lip, actually both of them. I have to, to draw them on every day. So covering them with concealer is absolutely the best. Just completely giving myself a blank slate. Powder is next. I don't bake, I don't do any of that. I just did all this. I use a powder puff by Beauty Blender. I just sprayed on it, Urban Decay Ultra Glow Setting Spray. And then I have Face and May Cosmetics Soft Focus Setting Powder. Makeup is setting. I've got my Anastasia Beverly Hills brow powder and chocolate. Wear, okay, I wear natural black eyebrow <clears throat> wigs. That's what they're called. Eyebrow wigs because I, you glue these on. If you can see, there's hair. It's just glued on to me. There's all different kinds if you Google eyebrow wigs. Okay, we're in a hurry, so I just did a thick, I'm just doing a thick black line of eyeliner, just so my lashes look good. If you have eyelashes, and you're doing makeup in a hurry, you don't, you can skip this step, just put on some mascara. Now, one thing I always do while I'm waiting for the glue, because you know I use a lot of glue because I have no lashes, while I'm waiting for the glue to dry for my lashes, I keep working. Um, I forgot to put on my Shadow Thirst. This is Hard Candy, and it is a eyeshadow marker. 
that's what they call it. It's a copper color. I'll put the actual color below, but look at this. So, my eyeshadow is done. I'm just going to tap out the edges. The way we take off, the way we remove this, our setting powder is with a big brush and some e.l.f. HD Perfect Finish Powder. Boom. Always use this. I use it right now in my process because I'm actually going to remove the setting powder, which only needs to be on two or three minutes, with the Perfect Finish Powder, which stays. Second lash. Got glue on it. Morphe bronzer. I like to put mine on top of the finishing powder. Still got the lash in my hand, and I've got some blush. I decided to wear really big lashes today because I'm doing really fast makeup, but I want to be glam. So one easy way to accomplish that is just a big lash. It always looks glamorous. We're gonna line our lip. I've got Morphe Sleet Tea, and I have to draw the shape of my other lip because it's not a lip. I have the matching sweet tea lip snatching sweet tea lip gloss. I have some very champagne colored highlighter by Ciate. Like, like Mr. Bentley I spotted her like Spud McKenzie And for them fake boobies I paid them Benjis Get your own I got Paris, he got Nicky He tried to get him a clone He said, yeah, you know you got extra hoes